one thing that makes me feel good, helps me to alleviate the anxiety about everything that's going on is that I just keep in mind to me that this is the beginning of our journey back. Sal's hitching us up. Yep, that's what he's been looking like all day. What, Sal? I just, I think it's pretty straight. I'm, I think it's pretty uh, lined up now. If you want to check it, I'll just Okay, let's it see in. how he did. He lined it up. So basically, Sal lines it up. And then we uh, have him back it in. And once he has it lined up properly, looks like it's a little to the right. Let's check it again. It looks pretty good. Well, that was a quiet hitch up. One of the quietest I've ever heard. It's in. It's hitched up. You did it, and it was so quiet I didn't even know you hitched it up. Mm. Cool. Sal's stressed out yeah. because why are you stressed out, Sal? Well, because we have to go on the road. We have to travel tomorrow, and I don't know what it's going to be like. It's the first time we've traveled for over a hundred miles since I think when we went to uh, Yuma, and just with everything going on, I, I don't know what to expect. See Sal's troubled look? That's his troubled look. And we got Allie. Allie? Allie. Allie coming into the RV. I mean the truck. We're headed to Sedona and hopefully everything will go smoothly. And we just had to move to a warmer, a cooler climate. Cooler. It's just yeah. been getting too hot here. and. You know, the hotter it gets, the more you have concerns about snakes and scorpions and tarantulas. And so we're moving and wish us luck. And uh, after we made our last video, the, uh, the governor of Arizona issued a stay at home order. And so we had to hurry up. We wanted to hurry up before, you know, while we could still move, we wanted to go ahead and move while we still could so that's why we're moving and if we have to stay in Sedona for you know a month then we'll stay there for the month at least it'll be cooler yeah um, we'll see how it goes all right so has been kind of troubled I think he'll be better once we get to Sedona I have a feeling he'll he'll be better but we'll see that's where we were parked are you sad about leaving LTVA? A little bit, yeah. We met some nice people here. Yeah. It was fun. I'm glad we got the permit. Me too. It was definitely worth it. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get on the road. One thing that makes me feel good helps me to alleviate the anxiety about everything that's going on is that I just keep in mind to me that this is the beginning of our journey back.
what's that all about? Henry! What? Driving through a place where there are tons and tons of swirl cactuses, tons of them. Wow, look at all them. Wow, wow, wow. So we're on our way to the Cottonwood Sedona area and it was a lot warmer when we left it. It's really starting to cool down. What did you say the temperature was when we left Portsite? 79 degrees. It was 79 degrees and now it's 66. 66, it just it, went down two degrees over the last two minutes. Yeah, it was just 68. But the reason for that is that um, the elevation, we passed a sign that said 4,000 feet elevation. So I think Quartzsite is no more than a thousand and I don't even know if it's that it might be like 300 or something the elevation is a lot lower but it, it's way higher here so that's why it's so much cooler another thing is the I showed the saguaro cactuses earlier and there were so many of them and now there are none none at all and the reason for that is because they can't grow up here it's too cold so or for whatever reason they can't grow here enjoyed it when we were here two years ago. We didn't come back here last year, but we really enjoyed it two years ago, and it's nice to be back here again. Hello, Holly. What are you doing, Holly? You relaxing on the floor here? Yeah, it's a little warm, so Allie's relaxing and trying to cool off a little bit. Hope you can see him. Seymour's over here. You hanging around, Seymour? And Henry. Let's see if we can find Henry. He's not in the carrier. He's not under the chair here. He's not in the tunnels. Oh, wait, there he is. He is in the, the, the cube. I, I looked for him and I didn't see him. Hello, Henry. I'm glad I found you. Henry likes to hide out. Right, Henry? <laughs> and Sal, Sal's giving a free show for all the ladies. Giving the ladies a free show, Sal? Yeah. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up below. And don't forget to subscribe.
Thanks for watching.